Question 982. Would you rather marry the hottest person alive or marry the smartest person alive? Mm. Smart. I Probably I tend towards smart, I'd say. Interesting. I tend to. Um, no, I mean... If the hottest person's lives a complete fucking idiot, then no, because that's a, that's a fucking turn. I don't matter how hot she is, that's a fucking turn off to me. And Jess is smartest. I agree, Jeff. Um, because looks fade, but having that brain you're compatible with is way more important at the end of the day. Mm. And Jess is smart. This is so sexy. I think we'll say that the the the, the hottest person alive. Is about average intelligence. Not dumb. Okay. No, it's still... Mm, no, I don't... Physical appearance is still fleeting. Yeah, I... I, I mean, there... I mean, there, it's... There are some people who make it to their 60s would... and 70s and 80s and are still even, even hot. Um, but... <laughs> 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 yeah, I will go with smartest. I would. Oh my god, the nerd rants. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't want it. Honestly, I, I'm I'm slightly shallow to a point yeah. because I don't want to date an, 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 an or spend the rest of my life with a really ugly person. The smartest person I, I alive just... is not very attractive. <laughs> See, you just made it tough, Dave. <laughs> Why do you have to put these stipulations in afterwards, Dave? Because I've got to balance um, them it's out. Basically, it's it, basically it's uh, do you prefer beauty or brains kind of thing is where he's going with this. I'm still yes. going smartest because I, my thing is not about um, looks, which is weird. Um, so I'm going for the brains because, yes, again, this, the nerd rants. Oh, my Jesus. And probably if they're the hot, hottest person alive as well, they may be of average intelligence, but they're going to fucking know they're hot. And that is something. See, uh, and that's a, that. And, I'll tell, and yes. I will tell you something. That is something is that that I is something that I cannot fucking abide. Is people who are, know they're fucking well. I'm. Um, what about people actually, that know I, they're I smart? Should, hold on, hold on. I should read. I should. I should <laughs> probably phrase this. Um, <laughs> let's let's put it this way. Um, <clears throat> Let's put it this way. Some girl who was, I mean, I will say was extremely, extremely attractive um, came on to me one time. I'd happened to, the thing was I happened to be engaged at the time. So it'd been a few years beforehand before I'd met this person and maybe, you know, but, and just didn't seem to get that I'm not, like, I'm not going to, I'm not going to cheat on my partner go and spend the night with her, even if she is fucking hot. And it was like, it, her, her whole attitude was, how dare you turn me down? <laughs> how dare you? Know, so like, See, fuck, that's, fuck off. Earlier, earlier I That's one of the problems um, I have with really hot people and really... And, and it's not even that the really <laughs> smart people, it's not just that they know that they're smart. It's the fact that they think everybody else should be as smart as them. Maybe. Um, earlier, earlier, so I, I really, mentioned... I really wouldn't want either one, Dave. On, <laughs> I mean, I'm assuming mean, that the the smartest uh, person alive will um, basically let me leave me alone because you know they think I'm an idiot. So, it's the smart, it's the smartest person alive. Has got a sort of personality. We say, I don't know, Sheldon Cooper off the Big Bang Theory. I'd be like, no, thank you. <laughs> That's true. Because I mean, let's be honest. Our parents, you know, someone who looks down their fucking nose at anyone who's got a one IQ less than them. What the fuck is that noise? What the what hell is that, is that noise? Quit that. Someone's doing their scratching, I think. Apparently. Yeah. Earlier, I had mentioned um, that there's been a number of, of uh, women I've met that just made me crazy. <laughs> Only two of them I would have considered hot. The rest <laughs> I would have considered a average to, to not attractive at all. It's something about the person, the, the vibes that just come through. Yeah, it sounds corny as well, but it's personality is a big thing to me as well. It, yeah, it is. It is. And I, I mean, yeah, I'd like to say I'd, I'd want to take the smart person, but 
Sheldon Sheldon Leonard must die. You know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Ricardo says um, I won't marry for no reason. It's against my religion. Rainberg says hotness is subjective. In the context of the question, the hotness is based upon you. Music yeah. Collector says best I'm expecting is a shag. Ricardo says intelligence slash smartness is hot. And Jer says if the hottest person alive is of average intelligence, then the smartest person alive has to be of average attractiveness. No, they don't. I write the rules. Uh, <laughs> Never again says I'd rather not marry again. I'm safe grins. Uh, so basically everyone wants to go for the smartest person I, I, I tend to go that way but you see would it, it would have been taken into account if you turned around and said that you know that the marriage is going to end after five years like ends, I said it, why it, bother it ends, it ends it ends why bother in the first place if you already know it's pre you know predestined to fucking fail most marriages are, but people go into them. Yeah, true. Well, true. <laughs> yeah, but you but true, hold on. Yeah, but you don't know that. Go. You, you, a lot of people don't no, no, no. know that. Again, going. statistically, yes, you do. Statistically, it's people probably going to fail. People, people, <laughs> don't look at, people don't look at fucking statistics, and people that do not fucking look at statistics or whatever going into these things because they're blind. Because even if it is completely fucking not going to work, you're blinded by fucking emotion. Like you're going to be the fucking exception. Yes. Oh, entirely. Totally people, agree. Because people have blocked. Because people are quite frankly blinded by this shit. You can tell yes. I'm not very much of a romantic. A romantic <laughs> can't you? I'm you're a new romantic. Jaded. I'm fucking jaded by this. By this. I'm shit not a. Ever. I'm not a big fan of marriage either. So. But if I had to marry somebody, I would still pick the smartest person because, again, like they could turn me on with nerd rants and I could just go have sex with someone else. I, I'm, um, I guess I'm really old fashioned. <laughs> surely, surely, knowing a marriage is going to end is the same as knowing a life's going to end. Does that not make does that does that make life meaningless? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Fair enough. Uh, Chad Hall says, "Best answer: hottest person alive. I could ha I could have a hot toy, and I could pontificate endlessly. She wouldn't be smart enough to know what I'm up to. Marriage is a word, bruh." So you see, so he's assuming that he's assuming it's going to be a complete fucking bimbo, then. <laughs> yeah. Uh. The binomial version of fuck, marry, kill. Aunt Jer says, if you went into it knowing it would only last five years, is it really considered a failure? Well, I wouldn't oh, consider it, so. Ricardo, by the way, please do not give him ideas for fuck, marry, kill questions. We haven't done one of them in ages. I have no idea. Coming what soon. Is. Coming soon. <laughs> Apparently so. <laughs> If you enjoyed that, please hit the thumbs up button. If you didn't, hit the thumbs down. If you think you've got a better answer or just want to tell us how wrong we are, leave a comment down below. Subscribe down here for new questions every day and make sure you hit the bell so you don't miss out on our live shows. If you click over here, you'll see our latest upload. Over here for what YouTube thinks you'll love the most. And finally, for a complete playlist of all our currently released questions, click here.